Hey everyone and welcome back to The Horror Show. I'm Cecil Laird. I'm Cecil Von Slaughter. And we're doing our spo spoiler review of the movie G Spoiler review of the movie Ginger Snaps. Yeah. <laughs> we just wanted to talk about a few things that we didn't want to ruin in our regular review. So what's one of the cool things you wanted to talk about? Something I really enjoyed about it was that Ginger actually turns into like full on werewolf. It's not, you know, just like a little bit of makeup effect. Right. Which oh, something else that's awesome is you see the transformation fully. And, Slow progression. Yeah, and then she full blown like snout and all that. Yeah. And, and that's the practical effect we were talking right. about. They do a full on wolf that you can tell a person is in it at points <laughs> because the back legs bend kind of weird, but it's still cool to see because the wolf is basically in their house chasing Bridget around, mm -hmm. and Bridget and Sam is the name of the guy that hits the wolf and helps her try and figure out what's going on with her sister. Mm -hmm. Sam ends up trying to be the hero, but ends up getting taken by Ginger. That's why you never be the hero. Yeah, yeah, Ginger Runs takes Sam out. and drags him down into the basement. Bridget slowly follows, and this is a spoiler thing I wanted to talk about. When she gets down there, Sam is still like twitching, like still alive and bleeding out on the ground, and Ginger Wolf is just like staying there and kind of growling at Bridget, and like she indicates for Bridget, like she wants to share her kill with Bridget. So Bridget gets down and starts putting her guy that she's now interested in's blood in her mouth mm -hmm. and she ends up vomiting it and Ginger Wolf picks up on it and starts to chase Bridget after first grabbing Sam's neck and ripping out his throat one mm -hmm. final time and killing him for good. And then Ginger chases Bridget around. Bridget ends up being enforced to finally at the very end, what does she have to do? She has to kill her. She has to kill her own yeah. sister. As her sister, she's not ginger anymore she's completely yeah. transformed so even the last vial of cure that bridget had it was too far gone she wasn't going to be able to do anything mm -hmm. so she ends up having to stab her sister and that's kind of what we go out on she's crying over her dead yeah wolf she actually well she, she lays on top of her until she takes her last breath yeah and she just is there just there and then literally that's kinda, laying on top of her right the giant werewolf yeah, body exactly <laughs> which is a cool final image to go out on so yeah. it was it was really neat one thing i really enjoyed it's truly the struggle is real for teenage girls because at one point they actually they really do go into werewolves you didn't know oh God. I thought you guys knew this. That's not a spoiler. <laughs> Everyone knows that. Yeah. But at one point, they actually kill one of... Well, they don't kill. It was kind of an accident the way it, ha it happened. Mm -hmm. That one of the popular girls smashes her head against the counter or whatever. Mm -hmm. And the parents then come home. So they take yeah. the girl and they put her into the outside freezer, like a giant freezer they have out there. And so they make it like a mock photo shoot that one girl lays down and they make it as if they were doing one of their one of photography their sessions. morbid photo shoots, yeah. Yes, and so then the mother goes into the where the freezer is to put meat away and Bridget goes in, she's trying to stop her and then also she has the freezer open, her mother's not looking into it and she's just staring and seeing the body of the girl. So the one thing she asks her mother- She's trying to, to keep her distracted. It says, what do boys want? And it, it I thought that was really cool because it it's, the mom like tilts her head. She's like, "Oh, my I'm daughter's so you asking that. my advice." Right, and so you she know, just throws the, next, the steak in and right, drops the Right, and the, the next freezer. scene is the girl with milk and cookies, and she's just standing there looking just horrified of everything she's hearing. But what I loved about that is it brought back that realness that they're still just young girls, mm -hmm, you know, mm -hmm. dealing with all of the you know morbid shit that's going on. Yeah, but yeah. it still it brings it back. Like, yeah, these are just still you know, young ladies. Yeah, it helped to balance the movie out. Right, yeah, yeah. that was something, yeah, I thought it was hilarious. Absolutely. All right, well, that's it for our spoiler review. Remember to like, favorite, and subscribe. You can follow us on Twitter. We're at Horror Show 666. Be sure to listen to our podcast and give us an email in the links below. Thanks for watching, you guys, and remember, stay, stay scared. scared. <laughs> <laughs>